I'm gonna start at a 60 overall, and every win that I get in this video is a plus one increase to my overall. I will be a 99 overall by the end of the video, but how many games is it gonna take me? I cannot cheat. If I'm stuck in an overall and I just keep losing games, I have to stay on that overall until I can get a win. Predict how many total losses I will have by the end of this challenge. Before we get started, let me answer some questions that you guys may have. Can I play any game mode? Yes, but I decided to play every game in the 1v1 Galleon so that I I didn't have any teammates to bail me out on the lower overall games. Can you buy VC to upgrade? Yes, this is not a no money spent challenge. I can buy VC if needed to upgrade the build. How did you get the attribute cap breakers needed to hit 99 overall? I grinded offline my career for days, which is something that I don't really want to talk about. It was a very depressing time in my life, but I did it so that I can go all the way from 60 overall to 99 overall in one video. What build did you do this challenge on? I completed this challenge on my new 6-8 demigod build that I'll be dropping a build video on soon if this video goes crazy and last question how long did this challenge take to complete from start to finish playing all the games grinding my career for the cap breakers and editing the entire video it took me a total of 17 days i put my blood sweat and tears into this video sub up if you guys are new and comment if you're subscribed i'll be harding and replying to a ton of comments now that you guys know how the challenge works it's time to jump into game number one as a 60 overall uh this is gonna be bad Okay, we are live. This is the beginning of a brand new series on my channel where I'm going to be winning a game at every single overall. You guys see I'm on a 60 overall. It's going to be my new build too. So I'm going to grind this build out, hit 99 overall on this series. This will maybe make the game a little more fun. This build cannot max at 99 already. That would be kind of crazy. So let me show you guys a few things before we go into it. This is the build. It's a 6-8. It's gonna be my new new uh, best build, I guess. Um, I, I don't have a 6-8 yet, so I figured I would try it. I heard they're pretty good. And I was in the My Player Builder for a decent amount of time. I looked at it, you know, two different days. And this is the build I came up with. Um, it can go to a 90 right now because it's a rebirth. So once I get a little higher in overall, I have to play my career off stream to get the cap breakers. I'm not going to play in park to get the cap breakers because that would be weird. That'd be cheating. So that's going to be kind of annoying playing my career. Badges. I'm a rebirth build. So I do have a few badges now. They don't really do anything. Aerial wizard. Like that's not going to help. I'm going to play ones. I'm going to play ones. At least for now. Aerial wizard doesn't help. Pro touch doesn't help. I don't use that because I haven't upgraded my build. So I can't even put on any of the good badges. But I do have some. You guys see i got some shooting badges we got some playmaking badges a lot of them are not useful the takeovers we got sharp and we got lock i don't have any perks this first 60 overall game about to be hilarious i actually think i can win it though i think i can win it can i actually win the game we are starting off with game number one as a 60 overall you see me loading in here we're gonna fast forward some parts of this video because you know this video will be like 10 hours long if we didn't but we're playing a brown shirt but he has shoes on. So is he a fake brown shirt? We're about to have to find out. And you guys can see, I'm a 60 overall, level two. You know, I hadn't really played too much current gen this season. Um, but you see, 60 overall. I'm not cheating. Game one, but he's a 93 overall. And he's a decently high level. So this dude's a fake brown shirt. Why are you even doing that, bro? Like, why are you messing around like that? And he's starting off with ball. Teddy Fresh gonna go by me, get a bucket. He's pulling a midi and he missed it. But he got his own board, bro. It was so tough to do literally anything. I couldn't rebound. I couldn't take layups. Bro, it's it's tough as a 60. You guys see, I gotta stop though. It's our turn. It is our turn as a 60 overall. First possession. This is probably gonna be the toughest game of the entire video. And I'm going by him. But I can't get the layup to go. Like, bro, I can dribble a little bit. I know my ball hit us low, and, you know, I got no dribble moves, but I'll be able to move a little bit. But, bro, I can't get any animations, and this dude is sparking. I'm down 9 nothing to start the game. He's pulling again, and he missed it, but we got the rebound. Okay, 9 nothing. Can we get our first bucket? You see me dribbling around. Okay, he's sagging off me. I'm going to have to pull a shot. And it's green! My first shot of the entire challenge, 60 overall to 99, was a green. He sagged off me. My midi's what, like a 45 right now? It doesn't matter. We're Honestly, I don't know how I greened it. I guess I'm just like that. I'm the best 60 overall you're ever going to see. And I scored again, 9 to 4. I got him jumped in. Another layup, 9 to 6 in the hardest game of the challenge. Hopefully, we win this one and we can go on to 61. You know what I'm saying? Upgrade a little bit. I'm going by him again for another layup. 9 to 8. We're in it. He's sagging off. Do I pull a 3? No. I walk in, take a midi, and it's not good. Okay. Maybe it was a fluke. Maybe I'm not actually like that. 
you know, I still think it is pretty crazy that I made that first MIDI and I greened it too. Now I'm bringing it out seven seconds left on the clock. This fake brown shirt, it's gonna get the stop me, bro. It's not fair, bro. It's not fair. And it's not just like a random, like 93 overall. Like, this kid actually knows kind of what he's doing. Look at him. He's dribbling around, comboing up, going by me, bro. I have no speed, literally. What is my speed right now? Like a 40, 40 XL? How am I supposed to guard someone that knows what they're doing as a 60 overall? Like this challenge is gonna be a struggle, but we're gonna do it. This is just the beginning. This is just the beginning. We're down 19 to eight. Can I get a stop? Yes, I can. We, oh, we didn't get the board. We didn't get the board. And he walked back and shot the three. We lost game one, 22 to eight. And uh, this is going to be tough. This is going to be a tough challenge. I scored eight points on four for seven shooting. He had 22 on nine for 14. And you guys can see after the game, I earned 965 my points. But if I want to go all the way to 99, I got to grind a lot of my career. Because like I said, I'm winning one game at every overall, not 15 at 98 so that I can grind the cap. Because no, I'm going to do that in my career, which is going to be a ton of work that I'm not really looking forward to you. But you guys can see we're still a 60 overall because we didn't win. We cannot upgrade until we get a win, but we get another brown shirt. Is this the one? Is he a real brown shirt or is he a fake brown shirt? This dude is an 83 overall. He's a Twitch streamer. It looks like level 18, but how good is he actually? Because 83 isn't too impressive. Of course, it's definitely you know, better than my 60 overall. But he starts off with a layup, then he's taking a midi. He missed it, okay. He seems a little bit worse than the last kid, and his plan is to just sit in the paint. Now I'm thinking, do I pull a three? Yes, I do pull a three, but it doesn't go. My three-pointer, my three-point rating is what? Like a 50 right now? Like, bro, I'm not hitting. That's gonna be tough. My best bet is with a midi, even though my midi is low, but I feel like I can make more midis than threes right now. This kid is missing everything, but he just got like four rebounds in a row. Finally, I bring it down. I'm down six to nothing. And I'm thinking, what's the game plan? What is the game plan? I'm looking, do I shoot another three? No, I walk in, try to go around him. He's got his hands up, but I get a crazy dunk animation. I don't even know how I did that. No clue, didn't know my player could do that, but apparently we can. I hit him with the crossover, get by him. Layup is good, six to four. Okay, we're in this thing. He's playing the paint, but we're going around him. Six to six, another layup is good. Now I'm feeling myself. You see me dribbling, hitting him with the crossover. I figured out that crossover on these low overalls is gonna help me a lot because when i drive in hit him with the crossover a lot of the times they're gonna jump a lot of the times they will you see i miss a layup not really sure what my game plan is but this kid is not good i mean he's upgraded he's an 83 overall i'm only a 60 i'm pulling a midi it's not gonna go ah oh, this is gonna be tough bro this is gonna be tough he's missing again bro like bro you can score on me in such easily ways, but he's trying to force shit on me. Like I'm a 60. It should be pretty easy, but like just, just li ri really just shoot threes, shoot threes. And if I'm not guarding you, then just go by me. Cause I'm not going to catch you. My speed is low. I'm pulling a midi and that's not going to go. I'm like, bro, what do I do? I chase down the board, go out of bounds. Of course, with my luck, of course we got to go out of bounds. He misses another shot, bro. He's giving us all the chances in the world, but then he, of course, rips us, takes such a bad shot. Like, bro, this is the kid. This is the kid that we need to beat. He's out of the play. I'm trying to drive in for a layup, but somehow he recovers in time when it looked like I had a clear layup. Missed that layup because I'm thinking, bro, what do I do? Do I keep shooting middies with a 50 midi? Is that my best bet? Do I pull threes? I don't know. But this kid's starting to hit shots. It's 11 to 6, and I'm like, bro, this is going to be bad, bro. If I lose this one... I mean, I need a blessing from God. I'm gonna need a 60 overall to, to go up against. And how many of those are there in the game? There's not too many. Like, I might be here all day. I might be here for weeks at this point. You know, that's, that's what I started thinking. I miss another layup and I mean, this is just tough, bro. It is tough to play in a 60 overall. I get the re rebound, like this kid's not good. Do I shoot a three? No, I walk in, take a midi and I green it. Okay, that's the strategy, 13 to eight. But it's like, how consistent can I really be for MIDI? And at this point, I'm pulling another. But it's just, I, I, I can't physically hit every MIDI with a 50 MIDI. You know what I'm saying? I could green a couple here and there. But it's like, that can't be my game plan. That can't be my game plan. If I want to win a game, though, I probably got to hit a few of them. But I can't consistently be shooting them. And this kid's just sitting in the paint with his hands up. So I don't know what to do, bro. I keep shooting MIDIs. They're not falling. And he's going to take a dunk. And of course, by the way, I have on default animations, default jumper. That's going to be something to follow. Something interesting is as I get higher overall, I can get 
better animations and I can get better jump shots. But for now, everything is just bad. Literally everything is bad. These are the toughest games of the entire challenge. He's sagging. I pull another midi but miss. It's 19 to 10. He's going to hit me with a walk back. And unfortunately, we lose another game 21 to 10 i had 13 rebounds he had 15 i was 5 for 15 0 for 1 from 3 we did shoot our first three-pointer but wow this is going to be a tough challenge we move on to 0 and 2 is the next game going to be the game where we finally get a win the matchups in this video are very important we got to get good matchups but who am i going to play 2k sh oh no, this is not. I mean, I'm a 60 overall, and I'm playing someone that is fully matching. Someone that looks like that gotta be good at the game, right? Oh my god. 96 overall, level 33, honor, Braun. I'm done. I, you can't, bro, going into this game, like, if I beat this kid, he needs to retire. It's that bad. I do get a bucket. That crossover is glitchy, but that's about the only thing glitchy about this game because he got the ball back and. I mean, that's all she wrote. We lost the game 21 to four. I did score another bucket though that I didn't show. We are at four points for that game, two for 10. And we're moving on to an 0 and 3 record. Oh man, I mean, this might be a long video. Hopping into the next game and okay, here we go. We finally have someone that's not a fake brown shirt and they also don't look too comp. He doesn't have on the BLM clothes. So you gotta respect that. You guys see, we are a 60 overall, still 0 and 3, but oh my God, Quackalicious 89 is a 65 overall is this a miracle is this a blessing from god look at the shot he's taking oh my god we get the ball and this kid's talking in game chat you see his mic going in you know what i'm saying right next to his name at the bottom and i'm going and i'm taking a layup oh no and don't tell me i'm gonna struggle against quackalicious 89 there's no shot right look at the shots he's taking that's a shot clock violation and by the way this kid was talking shit this kid was talking a lot of trash in game shot as I green a midi to start things off. That's a good start to nothing. I'm dribbling around. He's starting to jump at the midi. He's scared of me. He's scared of a 60 overall with a 50 mid range shot. He's just going to keep on missing laps as I get the board, bring it out. And man, he was talking smack the whole game. I go by him with the, with the little crossover, get the layup to go for nothing. And at this point, he's jumping. I got this man shook. Ma ma matter of fact, let me let me add in that he is like 10 years old. So also once I heard his voice, you know, I kind of knew, you know, that a good shot to play good in this game. And, you know, I needed to capitalize. I needed to capitalize. Ain't nothing I'm pulling. I'm confident. I'm confident. This is the one. This is the one. I go right by him and he's still talking. He, like whenever I would make a shot, he'd be like, you can't do that again. You can't do, you know what I'm saying? I'm about to get the ball and I'm about to beat you. He was talking smack. He was talking smack. I ended up messaging this kid after the game. You guys will see, but I'm going by him again. 16, nothing. Double takeover. We got to win this one. I'm thinking, do I shoot a three? Walk back. First three of the video to go in. There it is. The first three. That's a milestone. 19 nothing. Is this it for game? He's jumping. I got the layup, but I'm trolling him. I bring it back out. He's jumping for joy. He has no clue what's going on. We get the layup to go. Our first win is in the books. 21 to 0. 21 nothing? Like that quack delicious? 21 on your head? 10 for 12, one for one from three. I decided to send a message. I said GG, because you know, when someone talks like that, you just gotta send them a message just to get in their head a little bit. It's just kind of, it's, it's just funny to me, you know? I'm not actually trying to be mean, but he said add me. So I was a little confused. I was like, you're talking all that trash, but you said add me, and then he said, okay, just add. I said, why? And he said he wants to play 1v1. Quack delicious, if you're watching this, shout out to you. Because, I mean, you were talking trash, but, you know, you're a supporter or whatever. So, I appreciate you. But, look, it's time to do our first upgrade. I'm looking around. Driving dunk. Okay. If I put this up, you know, I can go to 61 overall. So, that will be 72 driving dunk for 10.6K. I could do a 72 driving dunk. That's a solid option. What can my three go to if I wanted to do that? 69 three-pointer. That's solid. Not the best. That'll cost me 3K. Moving on to the ball handle. Looking at this. What can my ball handle go to? 72 ball handle for 4K. You know, there's probably better options. And after looking at all of the options, you know, I looked at acceleration, stamina, all the solid attributes, I decided to go with three point. 
spent 3k vc to put us at a 61 overall our first upgrade now we have a 69 three point and we are a 61 overall now that we got our three point upgrade a little bit it's time to continue the streak can we get back to back wins we're a 61 overall and we are playing someone that once again does not look two comp you know he's got on the 2k generics we are a 61 overall as you can see and this kid is a 67 overall level one that is one of the best things that i can see in this entire challenge and first play this kid's trying to post me up i'm thinking am i playing a post score no this kid just sucks bo goku 10 and you know me i gotta try the three point shot because we upgraded it and of course you know maybe we didn't upgrade it enough we're still only a 61 overall what's the three point i think a 67 and and i get the ball back and i'm thinking i gotta try it again maybe it was a fluke no it really wasn't a fluke my three pointer still sucks so even though i'm a 61 overall i still don't have much help but i am gonna get a layup this kid got tired of missing shots and he just stood there he just let me take a layup i'm gonna get by him right there for another layup we are up four to two at this point can we get back to back wins that would be crucial he is going to block me off here and that's something that we're going to see a lot of people do we've already seen it in the first four games people love to just stand in the paint they let me shoot let me shoot middies let me shoot threes but they'll stand in the paint with their hands up they don't really jump too much i mean if they're bad at the game they'll just start randomly jumping but they'll just stand in the paint with their hands up and force me to shoot with my non-upgraded build now this kid's jumping that crossover is glitchy. I told you guys before. That crossover is going to get me a lot of buckets. I'm comboing up. I'm getting by this kid. He's playing me high for some reason. I think he forgot that I'm a 61 overall because he started playing me high from three. Now, right here, you know, I'm going to miss a couple layups. Drive back in, miss another layup, and it's Goku's ball. But can he do anything with it? No. This is one of the worst people that I have ever gone up against. I'm up 10 to 2, but he's not out of it. I can lose a game against someone like this because I'm only a 61 overall, but he is not playing. He's cold. I, he, he probably threw his controller. He's angry. Comment down below. If you're still watching this video, comment. What was B.O. Goku doing whenever he stops playing? Because he does it multiple times this game. You see he's doing it again. What was he doing? It's 18 to 2. I go by him again. He's probably furious. He's losing to a 61 overall. I have double takeover, and I'm thinking, you know what we got to do. We upgraded our three. We got to win the game on a three so i step back pull the three with double takeover but it doesn't go it goes back to goku but of course what does he do he makes a couple bad takes you know what i'm saying taking some bad layups i'm blocking it i got locked take 20 to 2 i step back for three and i missed again but i got my own board you know what i'm saying like coach always says you gotta follow your shot get your own rebounds i step back for three again and oh my god bro i mean i might have to upgrade three right after this game you know what I'm saying? It's that bad. He's not playing. I step back for three. And there it is. 23 to two win. Now we can go to a 62 overall. Our record is what? Two and three, I believe. And look at this box score. He was one for 24. We were 11 for 33, which is crazy. One for seven for three. But we had 21 boards and he had 23. Now it's time to back out. Look at what we can upgrade. Our three can go to a 72. So it's not much of an improvement. 72 is still pretty bad. And our driving unit can go to a 67, which is 4.8K. That's what we ended up going with. So now we are a 62 overall. And it's just a matter of upgrading the right thing. After we get a win, we got to upgrade the right thing. And something I forgot to do after last game was create a jump shot because there are a few new jump shots we have unlocked. And Hefty, I know you're watching this video. Hefty Block was in my chat. He's a viewer, supporter of mine. And he put me on this jump shot. For some reason, he has the best 61 overall jump shot written down or he's used it before or whatever. And he put me on to this Montrez Harrell, Ray Allen, Tobias Harris jump shot. You guys see the A grades in the bottom right. Why do you know this jump shot hefty? We're not really sure, but we're going to try it out. Jumping into the next game, and we got an opponent with a red shirt. Doesn't really tell us much, but what's his overall? How good is he actually? We got an 86 overall X Hezzy CF. So he's got a little 2K clan going or whatever. And you guys see me. 62 overall. Can we get a three game winning streak though? We finally start with ball, which I think this is the first game we started with ball. Maybe I'm wrong, but. We basically didn't start a ball because we gave it right to him on a missed layup. He's going to go by us and take a dunk. Okay, that doesn't really tell me much. I'm going to have to see something from him. Can he dribble? Can he shoot? He misses his shot, but he gets his own board, misses again. We get the board, and it's going to be tough to get rebounds because we haven't upgraded it yet, but I go right by him and use that driving dunk. That driving dunk that we just upgraded is in use 
and in effect right away and it is once again four to two if you guys know me you know that i like to you know use quick drops you know i, I don't think we yeah we can't get those yet we get that at 80 driving dunk but once i get those that's gonna be on my game plan so that's why i kind of started the upgrade driving dunk if you were wondering you're probably like solo you gotta shoot better you should have upgraded three point maybe even ball handle but look I think the most OP thing in the game is quick drops, which you get at an 80 driver. Like I said, it's one of the best dunk. It is the best dunk package in the game. So once I get that, I'll be unstoppable. So we just got to keep upgrading the driver dunk till we can get there. And I'm taking a shot using that three point, not the three point, but that jump shot that Hefty gave me from the chat because I was live streaming this. If you guys go to my live tab of my channel, you guys can watch all the live streams. If you think that for some reason this these videos are fake, they're not. But I'm thinking, damn, maybe the jump shot isn't that. I'm taking a midi. It's not going in. And I, maybe that messed with me because I was kind of getting used to the other jumper but you guys see 20 to 6 he went for swag and missed it then he ripped me but it's still my ball can i pull off this comeback 20 to 6 if i pull off this comeback i'm the greatest 62 overall to ever play the game i'm in the corner greening up a lot of people in the chat were telling me solo start to shoot from the corner it's easier in the corner which i think that might be true i'm not really sure but I said, screw it. All right, I bet I'm going to start shooting from the corner. I shoot again. It's a late. I'm not used to the full jump shot time. And this kid's spinning around. He's going for swag. He just needs one bucket to end it. Mitty is not going to go. I get the rebound. Bring it out. He's holding B. I'm going right by him. I'll take my points. If you're going to do that, hold your nuts or whatever. I'm taking my points. I'm taking my points. So I'm back in the corner. That's like my little office or whatever. You know what I'm saying? That's my little working area for, from now on. And I take a, a little dunk. I'm back in the corner. Step back. I'm thinking about shooting. And I do. But it's a midi. The game pushed me forward. I should have shot a three. But my feet were on the line. I shot a midi, which is not upgraded. And I missed. But he missed again. This kid's got double takeover. An upgraded build. And he can't finish out the game. We get a layup. 20 to 15. Can we pull off this comeback? What was he? 20 to 6? I'm driving in. He's kind of stopping me, which is not a great sign at the start of a possession. We bring it back out, and I just get by him. I don't know what happened there. He just kind of slid out of the way, and we get the layup. Or was I was it a dunk? I don't know. But 20 to 17, I'm back in the corner, and I got the three. But it's not going to go. He got the board, and all he has to do is make one bucket on a 62 overall, which shouldn't be too hard. He's trying to body me, but he can't do it. We get the board. Step back. I'm back into the corner. I got the three. I'm waiting. He's kind of baiting me. I'm thinking, is he going to play me up? Is he not? I go by him. We get the layup. Even though our layup's not upgraded, we're still getting it to fall. Come on. Oh, my God. Bro, how did I miss that? How did I miss that? I had a wide open layup, it looked like, and I missed it. I'm going. I'm fading for game. And it missed. And to be honest, I think it pushed me forward for a midi too, so it wouldn't have even been game, but he missed again. Oh, my God. How many chances is this kid going to give us? 20 to 19. We got to end it here because I don't know how many more chances he's going to give us. We're back in the corner for three. No. Oh, my God. I thought he would bite on it and guard my three because it would be for game. But he didn't really come out. I tried to get the layup. It didn't go. And we lost, bro. After all of that. We lost our record moves to two and four, 22 to 19 L, but wow, that was a tough L, nine for 22. We got to win the next one. We got to get back on a little winning streak here. And uh, jumping into the next game, seeing a guy fully tatted with a cowboy hat, just not the best sign, but when we wait to see what his overall is, you guys know I'm a 62. He's a 99, so... I mean, that's not a good sign. 62 versus 99. Yeah, uh, we know how that's going to go. We lose the game 21 to 8. I'm not saying I can't beat a 99, but, you know, that one just didn't happen to go our way. But we did score eight points. Jumping into the next game, and this guy is rich because I think that jacket costs like 26K VC to buy. He's at 95 overall. We're playing double H. HH, 9465, and we're most likely going to get another L, but we're not going to go down without trying. So once again, we go in, miss the layup, get our own board. He's jumping. We're, we're pump faking it. We're outplaying him. Maybe he has the better build, the more upgraded build, but we can outplay him. We can outsmart him as I green the midi. Go right around him. I'm cobbling up on a 62 overall. You guys see him. He's confused, I think, at this point. He had to stop playing. He put his controller down, and now he's back playing. I hit him with the meanest walk back that you'll ever see on the 62 overall, but I laid it because I think I was even shook that I just did that. We got our own board, though. It's 10-0. 
remind you, this is a 60, oh, 62 overall versus a 95. And I don't want this video to be like six hours long, so I'm gonna cut this up a lot more and we're gonna go through these games faster because this game right here actually did have a lot of missed shots. I know you guys may not think that because all you're seeing is buckets, but in the middle to the end of this game, there were a ton of missed shots. And I don't want you guys to just sit here and watch a 10 hour video because that's what it would turn into if we if we showed everything. I don't know how that layup went in, by the way. 18 to four, he got the ball back. Gonna take a crazy three, you could tell. This kid, not the most skilled. He does have the better build, but I'm somehow gonna miss a layup and I'm stuck in animation. I don't know if you guys saw that, but I couldn't even go for the rebound because I was stuck in animation. This kid gonna miss another shot. I'm cold. How am I gonna win this game? I'm spinning. Low key got him with that move, but he blocked it right into my hands though. And I got the bucket. 22 to six win. That's a huge one. That is a huge one. Now we can go to a 63 overall as we have beat HH. And look at this. I'm looking at my three-point shot. I can go to a 72. It'll cost us 2.8K. I'm looking at my driving dunk. That's another option because we do want to get to an 80 so we can get our quick drops. I started looking at everything. Ball handle. Stamina is even an interesting one. Keep in mind, only with 70 stamina for now. But what I decided to go with was that three-point to get us to a 72 three-point shot, which will help us a little bit. And now we're a 63 overall. Jumping into this next game, we're a 63 overall. Our record is three and five. We're getting a little bit closer to that 500 record. Are the losing days behind us? We got a little bit of a stage sweat. It looks like 95 overall. This dude's kind of dressed like he'd be in the stage all day. He's tatted. He got the little hat on, you know what I'm saying? I feel like we're playing a little stage guard. Got him jumping though. First play, we start out two nothing against KKRVN. I don't know how you'd say that. Craven, maybe. I don't know, but we get another bucket. Four nothing crossover. I'm just gonna work this kid in the post because he's a little body. You know what I'm saying? I got a little bro him drop step. He's gonna take the ball from me though on a weird little animation. Uh, I don't even know what you call it, but he got the ball, but we get it right back off a missed shot and we're going right back to the post spin move. Oh my God, how am I doing that? Is this the best 63 overall in the world? Bro, it's gotta be, I'm convinced there's no way. There's another 63 overall doing what I'm doing. Eight, nothing, and this kid's in danger. I mean, if you're this kid, 95 overall, you gotta start to worry, bro, because you're down 10 nothing against a 63 overall. I go right by him, crossover. It is 12 nothing. I'm about to get takeover. We're gonna keep working him in the post because we gotta get our wins any way possible. 14 nothing, double takeover, and I'm pulling a three. It's 17 to four. We hit a three. We're dominating this kid. Absolutely dominating this kid. I am gonna miss a shot though. You know, this game's not a perfect game. He gets the ball, gets the shot of choice, I believe. You know, I think, you know, stage guards like to fade, but I'm hitting with the Hezzy in the corner for three. And it's good. 20 to four. Oh my God, spin move. I lost my drill, but is it a problem? Yes, it is. You know, I, you know, I was gonna try and trick you guys. You know what I'm saying? I got the self lob in my, in my bag. You know, I gotta kinda, deep bag at 63 overall but you know it didn't work there but that's okay because we ended up getting the win 22 to 6 now our record is 4 and 5 and we can go on to a 64 overall you guys see 22 points on 10 for 15 2 for 2 from 3 we dominated that kid a 63 overall just dominated a 95 and surprisingly i'm gonna upgrade my stamina we're gonna get max stamina 95 stamina and be a 64 overall so we're getting that done with out of the gate hopping into our next game here and this dude is tatted he's got the mustache this dude looks crazy and that is not a good sign for us at all as he's a 90 97 overall rad russian is his name and i had no chance in stopping him as we're gonna go to four and six if we won that game we would have been 500 we would have been five and five it would have been all perfect but no rad russian had to ruin our dreams and hopping into the next game this kid looks like he's trying to be comp but he's not actually comp he's a 98 overall mtp baller but is he actually comp yeah um I mean, I don't know if he's actually comp, but you know, I'm a 64 overall and I couldn't beat him. So now we're four and seven. Our record is getting ruined. How many losses will we have by the end of this challenge? That's gonna be something that's very interesting. And I feel like once we get into a rhythm, as we match up against ISO cheese, ISO cheese, a 74 overall, that's a funny name. But once we get into a rhythm, 
I feel like it'll be pretty smooth sailing. It's just a matter of like what overall is going to be the start of our little groove. You know what I mean? The start of our win streak, our little rhythm. Uh, because, you know, these low overalls, this is the tough part. This is the tough part. We got a bunch of L's. We're four and seven. We're playing some dude named Iso Cheese. And if we can't beat Iso Cheese, then I don't know what to tell you. You know, he got the ball, started scoring a couple points. It's our ball. I'm thinking, should I shoot a three? Yes, I'm going to shoot a three, and it's good. Seven to six. We got the lead against Iso Cheese. We got to put him away because, you know, we're going to get very few games where, as I go out of bounds on a bad animation, we're going to get very few games reverse someone named Iso Cheese 9146. And, you know, when we do get ki kids named Iso Cheese, we got to capitalize, right? So I'm going by him 11 to 6. We got the lead. This is for 65 overall. And the bill's starting to come together. That's the cool part about this video, this challenge, is as I, and that's the meanest walk back of the 94th century right there as I green at midi. But as I, you know, upgrade the build and get these wins, we actually see the build come together. And eventually I'll drop a best build video because I think this build is fire. But we really see the build go from nothing to literally like, you know what I'm saying? Complete the best version of the build by the end of this challenge, which we will get there. 17-6 and ISO cheese is going to rip me, but I deny his shit. Oh my God. ISO cheese. What's going on? He's going to go for the layup and I stop him once again. He's going to miss it. Walk back for three in the corner. See ya. 20 to six. We need one more bucket. And there it is, Iso Cheese, get off my court. Our record is now five and seven. Okay, now we gotta lock in, clean up the record, 22 to six win. We were 10 for 14, two for two from three. Iso Cheese sent me some messages after I said, GG, I see he's a fan. He said he's a fan a year ago, but he forgot that he was a fan or, or I don't know, maybe he didn't know who I was, but he said, you don't need that take. No, bro, you weird. You have sharp take rim running. I said, I cooked. You slash take, he said, I think. I don't know. He's spelling stuff weird. And I said, no, you, in all caps. I thought that was pretty funny. Um, But, bro, really, like, I just beat you on a 64 overall. There's really nothing you could say. As I'm going to upgrade my three-point a little bit higher, now we have a 75 three-point, and we're a 65 overall. Because we did upgrade that three-point shot, now we are going back into the jump shot creator, and we can put on O'Shea Brissett, which if you guys have been watching my jump shot videos this year, you know that is one of the best bases in the game, especially for lower three-point rating builds. And because we do have a pretty low one with a 75, we're going to go with Brissett, Paul George, Paul George, and this jumper is pretty good for low you know three-point rating builds this is the one that we're going with hopping into the next game and this kid does not look too comp he's got a little sweatshirt on not really sure what it is but everything else 2k generic tree of Allah, 68 overall level 7 and you guys see me 65 overall so this is pretty fair at least that's what you would think but if you know me 65 versus 67 but i'm the 65 that's not fair come on now you know what i'm saying we're sparking Eight nothing, eleven nothing. We're sparking Allah. Step up, Trio Allah. Step up, bro. Another three. It's good. He couldn't stop me. We got double takeover. He's still sagging. We're pulling another three. It's green. He can't stop me. We're six for six, five for five at this point. I'm pulling again. He's not even moving. I would give up too if I was a 68 overall or whatever he is. And I'm down, you know, 17 nothing, 20 nothing to a 65. I'm pulling again. Oh my God. 23 nothing. And I just shot eight for eight, seven for seven from three on a 65 overall. That's crazy, bro. That's You got to give me my props. You got to give me my props. That is hard to do. And I'm looking. What should I do? Driving dunk. We also got three point. Maybe ball handle. Defense is still untouched. We also haven't done speed or excel. But I will go ahead and do driving dunk as we continue to get closer to that 80 driving dunk. Because once I get that, oh, I mean, that's all I need. You know, it's going to be pretty smooth sailing. Once I get 80 driving up and I can get quick drops and my three points pretty solid so I can shoot threes, it's clip. But we're playing Flug. Flug's a 92 overall, and he's going to miss the shot but chase down his board. That's a problem with my build right now. My speed is low, and also my rebounding is low. So a lot of the time, the other guys can miss shots but get their own boards. So it's like I can get a stop, but it doesn't matter because they're getting the boards. Now, Flug's going to miss a shot. Give me the ball. I'm looking around, maybe trying to find a shot. He's ripping me, but I get the ball, and I get a dunk off of it. It was a very weird play, but I get a dunk. It's two for two. Now I'm looking for a three, and I'm going to miss it. And uh, 
Wow, that's that's pretty much the end because Flug is about to take over. Look at him missing another shot, chasing down his own board because I'm just that slow and it's four to two. Now it's 19 to seven. Fast forward, Flug would double take over. I mean, it was just the Flug show, you know what I'm saying? Our record is six and eight, I believe, and we're a 66 overall. We gotta get our wins like, bro, we gotta stop losing. You know, the record's getting pretty bad. I know we're at low overalls, but it's time, bro. It, it, it's time to lock in. It's time to lock in, and our opponent is fully suited up. He's wearing the suit. He's got the red glasses. It's very serious for him. You know what I'm saying? It's like a business meeting for him. It's a business event, and he's a 95 overall. We got YSG Vaughn. That is not a great sign, but we're up to a 66 overall. Can we take on these big dogs now? You know what I'm saying? Now that we are getting some stats up, you know, we can score a little bit better. Can we take on these 90 overalls and, and you know, fight and maybe maybe get, get away with a win? You know, I feel like this is the test. This is the test right here. You know, first play, we got our own board, got the layup to go right there. We're just going to take the layup over him, 4 nothing, going to go around him, 6 nothing. The thing about this kid is, yes, he's upgraded, but he's pretty small. So I'm going to use my height to my advantage right there. It didn't work. You know what I'm saying? I, maybe I just jinxed it. Uh, whatever but Vaughn not too impressive he's gonna get a little spin I'm gonna jump at it for some reason and he's gonna get the layup to go he does score another point then miss a shot we get the ball back we're down six or we're up six to four and I'm gonna green the shot nine to four he's gonna score again I get the dunk 11 to six like I said before I'm gonna cut this up a lot because we can't just show every possession so sometimes you know he's gonna score but I won't show it and yeah you guys get that now I'm gonna take a dunk 15 to six and we have double takeover we just got to close out this game. You know what I'm saying? We're going to take a dunk right there, 17 to 8. Just close out this game, bro. And I'm pulling a three in his face, but it's good. I was so shocked when that went in. I don't even know how, bro. My three is not that high right there. I, it made me take a weird, like, step back three. It's okay, though, because we got our own board. Walk back, and I'm going right by you. We just beat a 95 overall as a 66. Bro, that's embarrassing. 10 for 16 from the field. 2 for 6 from 3. We got 7 boards, and that kid was boxed. Now, taking a look at the upgrades, I'm going to continue to do driving dunk. Now, it's not an 80 yet. We're 1 away. We're at 79. So, one more upgrade, and we have quick drops, which is the best dunk package in the game, in my opinion. We're literally not going to lose once we get that dunk package. Now, looking at the badges, we can take off Arrow Wizard, put on Slithery, and, you know, the badges are going to continue to get better as the attributes go up, because you guys know, you can't put on certain badges until you upgrade your build. So, maybe I'll have badges, but if my build's not upgraded, I can't use them. Let's lock in, jumping into the next game, and this kid looks pretty comp, but what is his overall? Because, obviously, that matters. 96 overall, angry tubs, and this dude's a very high level. He's grinding towards legend, and then look at me. I'm just a 67 so this could be very bad but we're starting off with a quick bucket jumping into the next play a little fast forward right there i'm walking back angry tubs looks pretty solid he's gonna rip me and he's not even taking the bucket he wants to cook me so he brings me out to the right wing and you see the movement i mean yeah once i saw that i was like i'm not really gonna be able to keep up with this 13 to 2 fast forward he's gonna get another bucket 15 to 2 and look at what happens right here. Angry Tubbs with the ball is going to walk out of bounds. What is he doing? What is up? That's what Angry Tubbs is doing. So he's throwing the game. And I later found out he was in my stream. And at this point, I was like, yo, don't just let me have the win. If, like, try. Start trying. So he started trying. I had double takeover. I walked back and green the shot from the right wing so we get a weird win 22 to 15 i'll take it can't really control what the supporters are going to do but he did try at the end there and now we're 500 we got an eight and eight record and now we can go to 68 overall i'm looking at the three point you know what should we upgrade oh yeah also driving dunk that's going to be an 80 one to driving dunk and i believe it was two to three point now we have an 80 driving dunk and you know what time it is now that we got the 80 driving dunk i went into my dunks and I made sure quick drops off one, which is the best dunk package in the game, in my opinion, was the only dunk that I had equipped. Now it's go time. The lost days are behind us, whatever. The losing days are behind us. So we get a 99 overall. Baby goat is the opponent. 99 versus a 68 overall. Who's going to win? 
probably the 99, but let's get into it. First play, I take a dunk, and I made an emphasis this game that I was really gonna focus on quick drops. Just to show how OP that dunk package is, I was just gonna spam them every chance I could get. So I bring him out, quick drop dunk. You know, am I gonna shoot a three? Maybe he thought I was, but I went right by him. Once again, gonna run past him, caught him sleeping there. Eight nothing against Baby Goat. We're gonna bring to the left wing. Am I gonna shoot a three? He's respecting it, so I gotta respect that. I pull a midi and I miss. If I was a, if that was a three, I might have made it, but I have an upgrade on midi and I didn't get behind the three point line. So unfortunately it wasn't midi, but I get a stop on a 99 overall. I'm pulling a three. It's not gonna go. That's kind of awkward, but baby goat with the ball. Gotta get a stop here. It's a 99 overall. If he gets hot, he could easily win the game, but I get another stop. Oh my God. A 68 overall versus a 99. And we get another stop, a dunk and bang. Get by him again, another dunk. 12 nothing. What do you think's gonna happen next? Oh, if you guess the quick drops dunk, you got it right, 14 to nothing. What's gonna happen next? Oh yeah, another dunk, 16 to nothing. It's not even giving me the quick drops every time right there. It did 18 nothing, but uh, yeah, uh, this is, you know, this is all I have upgraded. So I'm going to use it. You know what I'm saying? You can't blame me. I only have driving luck upgraded and, and a little bit of three points. You can't blame me. 22 to nothing win over a 99 overall. That's pretty impressive. I don't care if he's not the best 99. That's impressive. 68 versus 99. That's crazy. That's crazy. We'll take it. Go on to the attributes. We get another upgrade, and I'm going for three point. We have an 83 point now, which is definitely, you know, good. Definitely going to help us out. Our offense is starting to get crazy. Going to have to do ball handle soon and then eventually get to defense. But now we're a 69 overall with a 9 and 8 record. If we win this game, we can go up to a 70 overall. Our record will be 10 and 8. This is a big game. This kid looks pretty solid. 97 overall, level 31. So maybe maybe he's gonna be kind of tough you know we're 69 we're starting to get in our groove you see we start out with a very good you know early lead nine nothing to start out we're gonna get a quick drops dunk 10 or 11 nothing against jaja and then i'm gonna go with this layup and miss it but i get my own board go up with it again and the rebound goes right into his hands and now this is where Jaja is gonna take over. You see, he's dribbling around, gonna go around me, take a dunk, 11 to two, and in the blink of an eye, it is 20 to 11, and then, bang, he wins the game, 22 to 11. So, I mean, that's tough, that's tough. Our record is back at 500, we're nine and nine, as we lose 22 to 11, and now we are playing Ice Spice in this game, and we can't lose back-to-back -back times. We, we really can't afford to lose much more in this entire challenge, but we can't lose back-to-back -back times. This guy seems pretty decent. Ice Spice with a three to start things off. We're going to call him, you know, we're not going to call him Ringer. We're going to call him Ice Spice. He's going to go up with a layup and he's going to miss. I get the board. We're going to bring it out. Look for our shot. He's leaving us open. Green, you can't leave us open. A lot of people left us open for some reason. Well, that's it's not for some reason, because I kind of get it. If I'm bursting the low overall, I'd probably leave him too. But little do they know, I'm actually, you know, a guy that has some higher overalls. I'm just doing this for a challenge. And we're fading. Oh my god, that was a midi too. I think that makes it more impressive that that was a midi. Our midi's not even upgraded. What do we have? A 50 midi? This guy's confused. He's running all over the place, not guarding me on defense. Still letting me shoot 15 to 7. He has takeover. I have takeover. And he's jumping like, bro, I'm, I haven't even upgraded my ball handle like that, bro. And you're jumping like, this is embarrassing. I'm dribbling around, kind of cooking him. Oh, my God. Where are you going? Step back for three. It's good. 20 to 7. One more bucket. And we're an 80, or not an 80, a 70 overall. Bang. We green the three. 23 to 7 win. It's time to go to the attributes and put us at a 70 overall as I believe I upgraded ball handle. It kind of went a little quick there, but we believe we did ball handle. We're at a 70 ball handle, yeah. And I went to look at my playmaking moves and they are all still restricted. We can't do anything with a 70, but at least we're working towards, you know, a higher ball handle. Now, we are finally in the 70 overalls. We are done with the dreaded, terrible 60s. You know, that was a bad time for us. We went 10 and 9. But look, we're playing Ty Ty the Goat 7754. And that's his first shot. 
That's all we need to know. Ty Ty sitting paint. I'm gonna green the shot on the left wing. He's still sitting in the paint. I'm gonna green another one. We go up six, nothing on Ty Ty. This is another example. People like to leave low overalls wide open. We start out three for three, another green, nine nothing, another green, 12 nothing. He is still disrespecting me and I have takeover at this point. And I guess he's smart for that because I did miss. And then Ty Ty, you know, showing us what he's made of with the green and then back to his old ways, missing, giving us the ball back 12 to three, 15 to three. I did cut out some misses, so I wasn't going, you know, absolutely crazy right there. I left one in. He's going to green another one, 15 to six. We're just having like a three point contest at this point i'm gonna get the board he's flopping he knows he's done well i was missing a few to be fair but i don't know he's, he started flopping i guess he gave up ty ty got tired of playing 2k and he gave up back to the upgrades we're doing more ball handle up to a 75 ball handle now the build started to come together nicely as we are now a 71 overall before we jump into the next game we gotta quickly look at our badges because our ball handle is higher now we can put on a ton of these playmaking badges that i couldn't put on before because my playmaking had not been upgraded so now we got clamp breaker handles for days mismatch expert quick first step we got unpluckable on silver which is going to be huge huge and we are a 71 overall jumping into this next game but who are we playing we got a 95 overall named iso x god i mean we'll find out about that we'll find out how true his name actually is jumping into the game it's three nothing him and he misses a dunk meter dunk so i get the ball pretty quick you know what i'm saying i'll take that i mean it's not really a stop but i'll take it he just missed and we get two quick buckets now we are down four to six once again cutting out a lot of the misses because we don't want a nine hour video seven to six after i hit the three nine to six and i have double takeover are the loss, the losing days behind us? I mean, we're starting to really get in a groove here and it's starting to get scary. A lot of people in the chat when I was streaming were saying I was the best, you know, 71 overall or whatever overall that they've ever seen in their life. A lot of people had to, you know, had me show them the attributes for them to believe that I was actually a 71 overall because I was going just that crazy. You guys see 18 to six, a three will win it. I'm comboing up on this kid going right by him. Keep in mind, I'm not even fully upgraded. I haven't really upgraded the Excel yet. The speed, I'm still slow. As we green that, midi, not even upgraded yet. 22 to six win, 10 for 15 from the field, two for five from three, and I'm going for ball handle. We're getting an 80 ball handle, and that should unlock a ton of six. Take a look at the build. We got an 83, 80 driving up, and an 80 ball handle. Now the defense still needs to be upgraded, and also our physicals. We did do stamina at one of the early overalls, I think like 64. But as you guys can see here, a lot of the dribble moves are now unrestricted, if that's you know that's one way you could put it and now i have some dribble moves i still don't have all of them i don't have my dribble style i don't have my six size up but i got a decent amount of the dribble moves so now first game with some sigs on we're versing it's miles 86 overall i'm just gonna be honest if i'm seeing an 86 overall common tier level seven i know i'm only a 72 but that's a great sign that's a matchup that I will take all day as long as I don't see no, you know, 99. Actually, matter of fact, I just remembered on current gen, apparently whatever your tier is, let's say, you know, your you the common tier, silver tier, bronze tier, gold tier, all that on your build. Apparently your opponent, it glitches and it says that they are the same tier as you. So a lot of these people that I'm playing might be goat tiers. They might be gold tiers. I just remember that fact. People in my streamer tell me, but you guys see, I'm going crazy with the SIGs. I'm greening up 100% from three. Look at me, just comboing up. It's like, bro, I had not used SIGs in so many games. So you already know I had to use them. I had to just kind of dribble around for fun. This game, you know, I dribbled around a little too much right there. Uh, you know, I was long stamina, so I missed a shot, but we got our own board. As I said earlier, my coaches always used to say, follow your shot. And that's what we did. We're dribbling around. This dude's lost, bro. He's lost. He's jumping at us nonstop. It can't, it, it's at the point where I almost think he's trolling. Something weird happened right there. Ball went out of bounds, but it is still our ball. But it's really at the point where either I'm just that good or he's trolling because he, this kid's jumping around way too much. Like he's not even trying to block shots. Like look at this. I'm dribbling around. I'm gonna go by him. I think he has a crazy jump little episode here soon. Right there, I get a bucket. Maybe it's on the last play. We have it's Miles down 20 to nothing, and I am open for three. Never mind, he doesn't jump. But I'm pulling from the parking lot. Oh my god. 13 to nine record, and now we can go up to a 73 overall. 23 to nothing. 
what a crazy game and i'm looking at excel i'm thinking should i do excel the ball handles pretty high some other stats pretty high but excel if you guys know about dribbling you know excel matters a lot if you want to dribble fast you know run fast at your dribbles you need to upgrade the excel so we did our excel a little bit now we're at 73 overall and we're playing grant i believe that says 91 overall he made the first shot second shot timed it pretty good but he dribbled too much his stamina was low and he missed it he's disrespecting the shot and it's like, bro, how many people are going to disrespect the shot? We're going by him. Now he's respecting a little bit. It looks like he's getting like stuck behind the hoop right there. We're going by him again. Just some quick buckets. Nine to two. Grant, you got to get a stop soon. I got a double takeover. You're losing to a 73 overall. Like that's another thing. It's This got to be pretty embarrassing for a lot of the people that I'm playing because they have maxed out builds. You know, they see a brown shirt, 73 overall, or even earlier in the video, like 60 overall, 65 overall. And you think, oh, that's a free win. And then you get ran out the building by me. Like that's crazy. 17 to two, I'm just comboing up. The build is really starting to come together. I know you guys see it, bro. Like just a few games ago when we were in the 60 overalls, we were struggling. But look at me with the green, 22 to two. We're moving, we're greening good. Like a 10 for 13, two for four from three. And we're, we're starting to play good D, even though we haven't upgraded our defense, the Excel is up a little bit. And I don't know, we're just really starting to figure out the build. Now we're looking around, what should we do? Is it time to do defense? Not yet. We're gonna keep doing Excel, man. We are gonna be offensively really good. Now we have a 77 Excel, but I think we're gonna have to do defense here pretty soon as we are now a 74 overall. Is 14 and nine a good record for being a 74 overall and having to win one game at every overall? Like, I'm not sure. I feel like that's solid. We're starting to get into that solid range. We're playing Aiden Bug, you guys see. We're a 74 overall versus Aiden Bug. One, zero, two, three. We got to lock in. We got to lock in. We got to limit our losses. I'll say, like, throughout the rest of this, we should get no more than five more losses. I will give myself, like, five more max. And you guys see uh, Aiden Bug is a post score, and we lost 22 to 13. So, okay, that's another loss. Now we're 14 and 10. Okay, now we need to lock in. Now we need to get in a groove. Now we need to go on a little stretch here of games where we do not lose for the next like five to 10 games. You know what I'm saying? We're playing a 72 named, I think it said like the bear. 72, bro, he, the beard. He's worse than me. Worse than me. I cannot lose to a 72. You see me sparking six to two out of the gate. I get double takeover, speed things up here. He's jumping at me. We're gonna drive in, take the dunk, eight to two. But yeah, we gotta get in our bag now. You know, I'll give myself four more losses for the remainder of this challenge. I don't wanna pass, you know, 14 or 15 losses. By the end, we'll have 40 wins. We're at 14 right now, 74 overall. The build is starting to come together nicely. You guys can tell the dribbling is improved. Even my shot has improved. I'm not really missing. Like if I'm left open, I rarely miss. This kid has now given up the beard three has given up you know he's a 70 what was it 74 overall 76 something like that 72 i think it was a 72 and we're gonna get the win 23 to 2 over the beard i'll take it 9 for 14 from the field 5 for 7 from three like my three point numbers have just skyrocketed they have actually skyrocketed as i've upgraded this bill i'm thinking about what i should do and i go with excel to max out the excel and then we do a little bit more on our ball handle so now we are a 70 five overall the boot camp build you know what i'm saying 75 overall if you guys know you know when we're playing legit aim a 78 or 79 overall and his first shot is up and it is not good and you know just taking a look at legit aims player he's got on i think those are 2k generics he's got on i think the my career jacket for when you win a ring like you know if you see that it's pretty 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 good sign you know what i'm saying if you're playing park and you see someone wearing that it's a pretty good sign and we are sparking you know, this is pretty much a free one. I don't know how tall this guy is. Maybe he's six foot, but I am on a six foot eight build. And of course, guys, if this video goes crazy, you guys sub up a lot. It, you know what I'm saying? If I see a lot of new subs, if you guys go crazy on the like button, there's a ton of comments. I will drop the build video for this build soon. This is my new best build. I spent so much time in the My Player Builder working on it. And you guys see, I'm going crazy and I'm a 75 overall. We're pulling 18 nothing. Legit Aim has given up. 
I mean, I would probably give up too if I was, you know, losing this badly to a 75 overall and just had no chance. 21 0 win. Is that the best game yet? 8 for 8 from the field, 5 for 5 from 3. Is that the best game so far in the video? Is that the best game we're going to have this entire challenge? Legit aim stood no chance. And now we're looking at ball handle. We can go up to an 85 ball handle for 9 KVC. And that should unlock some more drill moves as I go, yeah, right into the animations. And the dribble style, that is with speed of the ball. So I haven't upgraded that yet. So we're gonna have to do that. But you guys see, I buy Tracy McGrady's SIG size up because that is the size up I use. If you guys watch my drill move video, you know, those are on my channel. I post best drill moves every single season. And Tracy McGrady's been the size up that I've used on taller builds pretty much since the beginning of the game, you know, since the game came out. And we are versing Pretty Boy Doe, 87 overall. So we have an 87 versus a 76. Who do you guys got to win this? I feel like when it's kind of close like that, like obviously they have a higher upgrade, but you know, I. I'm probably the more skilled player, the more experienced player. I, I feel like, you know, I'm pretty confident in those in those scenarios. Now, it's when I go up against a post score or when I go up against a 99 overall level 40, those are the games where it's like, all right, I don't know about this one. You know what I'm saying? I'm not really upgraded. I don't got D. It's going to be kind of hard to win those. But you guys see here, 4 nothing, pretty boy do, pretty boy do. What do you got? He's going to miss a layup, miss another layup, and we're going to get the board 4 nothing, pretty boy do probably a fan of pretty boy fredo maybe possibly he is gonna just stand still as i go past him six nothing now he is playing but it doesn't matter we're stepping back for three on the left wing nine to nothing we're going crazy right here's trying to rip me i know it's a little fast forward but you guys could probably see that and i we go in for the dunk another layup right there like i said i'm trying to fast forward as much as i can you know not show you too much of the opponent's possessions because who really cares about them you know what i'm saying we're, we're here for my journey 60 to 99 one win at each overall and pretty boy doe is respectfully ass i'm a 76 overall and i'm cooking his shit 15 not 15 nothing i was gonna say 15 not 15 nothing we have double take 17 nothing and he can't stop me i mean look at me i'm oh my god you can see like oh the six are coming together nicely now they got t max size up i got pretty much everything on except mj dribble style is the dribble style that i use and you know the excels maxed out the ball handles and added at an 85 now like i'm moving i'm moving we win another game 21 to nothing 21 to nothing i believe the record is what 17 and 10 at this point in time and we're looking at driving layup something that i haven't looked at yet maybe you guys would have upgraded it earlier but i'm gonna upgrade my driving layup up to a 71 and now we still have to do defense we still have to do speed and even speed with ball are some key categories that I'm going to have to upgrade here soon as we are now a 77 overall. We got a brown shirt opponent, but is he a real brown shirt or is he just clickbaiting us? He is just clickbaiting us because he's a 92 overall, but we're a 77. We're starting to get our overall up. So I honestly think we can compete against somebody like this. And I think we're on like a three game winning streak up to this point, which is probably like tied for our highest winning streak of the entire challenge. We got to start to go on some winning here we got to start to keep the record clean get the record nice as the build is really starting to come together you guys see we're starting off good in this game six to nothing against aq7 see i'm gonna dribble try to get around him get the quick drops just barely getting around him dribbling around right wing gonna get another quick drops and this guy's gonna flop now look at him i want you guys to keep an eye on this kid flopping because he's giving us some attitude i'm not gonna lie he's giving us some attitude i green a three right there because he's just giving us some attitude and we can't deal with it look i'm gonna go around him right here and bang he flops again and you just can't feel bad for someone like this if you're gonna play me high i'm gonna run by you and you're spamming your x button too so you cannot blame me for rim running i know you guys can relate people get mad at you for doing it but bro if you're going to play me mad high and just guard my three all game and you're going to spam X on top of it to try to get a steal animation. Oh, I'm going to run by you and I'm not going to feel bad about it. Like, you know, what I'm saying sag off a little play, a little different defense, or I'm just going to score every time. You guys see this kid uh, missing a three. He has double takeover at this point, 13, 19. So he's making the game interesting Gonna drive in, but I'm going to. Oh, I don't think I blocked it, but I got a good contest. 13, 19, one bucket will end it, and I get around him for the final bucket. 21 to 13 win, and now we can go up to 78 overall, but what do I want to upgrade? I'm looking at speed of ball, as you guys can see. 
We got some options. Defense still untouched, but I will go with speed of ball. Now it's a 68. We cannot get our dribble style yet, but I believe if we win another game, we can put that up to 75, and then we can get our MJ dribble style. We got a 60 overall. Remember what I told you? That says it's a bronze tier, but it's glitched. Whatever tier I am, as you guys can see, I am now a bronze tier 78. It's glitched. So this is a 60 overall, most likely a common tier. Elite Gus. Now, I'm not going to lie. For some reason, he kind of scared me. Like, I was... Because I think he's a post scorer, bro. Look at him. I think he's a post scorer. He's pretty tall. I remember playing this game, and I was like, yo, this guy, honestly, I, I feel like I should be a little scared, bro. Because if he's a 7-3 post scorer, who knows, bro? If he's good, he could back me down. Like, it could get scary, and we have not upgraded our defense yet. So I had to be very cautious this game i have takeover here yeah i'm gonna use it and we are up nine to nothing i'm pulling in the corner green light 12 to nothing like the build coming together bro i'm hitting my open threes pretty much every time at this time you see the dribbling the dribbling is pretty much you know at its best that it's gonna be at we, we you know i think there's one more dream we can get and we can put our ball handle up a little bit more of course there's some badges we can get that we don't have yet but look elite gus with the ball what's he gonna do he's gonna walk out of bounds He's a 60 overall, you know, that was kind of expected, man. I mean, not really, because, you know, you should still know to stay in bounds, but Elite Gus gonna, you know, he's got big feet. He's a 7-3, and his, his big toe just, you know, hit that out of bounds line, and he's gonna give us the ball back 19-0. to zero. Oh, no, don't do it to him. He's only a 60. Elite Gus. We're bringing it back. A couple snatch backs to the three-point line for three. Bang. 22 to nothing win can't really get too excited it was a 60 overall but now we can go up to a 79 overall we're gonna do speed of ball and then we're gonna do a little bit of speed because we're just gonna get our speed of ball up to a 75 no need to go higher than that right now because we do want to get that dribble style that is unlocked at a 75 and then with the rest like i said we're gonna do a little bit of speed and as you guys can see we're going right in dribble style michael jordan bang the drill moves are perfect these are the SIGs that I use on my actual 6'9", him build, the best build in the game. And here we go. 93 overall. I believe it said none like J. We are 79. Like I said, we can compete with people like this. It all depends on their skill level because who knows? Maybe this guy's got another 99. Maybe he's got a couple of them. Maybe he plays the game nonstop and this is a new build. You never really know. You can't judge a book by its cover. Now, he is wearing 2K generics. So that, that might save him. But like I said, you can't judge a book by its cover. And look at us. We're wearing two good generics too. We're cooking up, but we did miss a three. So it is none like Jay's turn. He's going crazy. He's going to drive in on us, but we do get the stop. He gets his own board and he's going to get the layup to go. Six, six, fast forward. Now it is eight, six. He's got the lead. Our win streak is in jeopardy. I believe up to this point, we are on a five game winning streak. We haven't lost since I believe 74 overall, maybe 73. And he's going to rip me. Easy bucket for him. Now fast forward, it's 17 to eight and he's got to get the green to go 20 to eight. Last chance. Win streak is in jeopardy. Can I get a stop in this kid? I got double takeover, but so does he. He's got sharp and rim, but he's dead. No adrenaline boost. Three seconds, two seconds. He's got to shoot something. Can we get the board? Oh my God, bro. We still have an upgrade our rebounding. Speed's still not max, but he's going to go out of bounds. Bro, when he did that move, I knew he was going out of bounds. I literally said it in the stream because if you're a dribbler and you ever accidentally do that move, you know you're going out of bounds. And then I hit him with the green from the hash. You guys know we got to lock in. It's now or never. Win streak on the line. We're going to run past him. Quick drops. 20 to 13. Can we do it? dribbling around can we do it he has rim takes we got to keep that in mind and we drive in and he's gonna get the crazy block honestly in the moment was not thinking that he had rim take was not focused on that but now we have two seconds got to shoot something could have made it felt like i timed it good but he did get a 70 percent contest 20 to 13 and none like jay is gonna unfortunately end our winning streak as that record goes to 19 and 11 we are a 79 overall. You guys see 22 to 13 loss. I shot six for 11, one for four. Definitely could have played better, but you know, none like Jay. He played us pretty good. Now, moving into the next game. Every game I've played where we play someone with a sweatshirt like this, they have not been good. And we're playing Kuno, I think. Was, I don't know if that's how you say his name, but he's an 81 overall. He was talking to game chat, to be honest. Forget what he was saying. Uh, so I can't really tell you what he was saying because I forget. And this kid's going to start off 4-0, but then he's going to miss a layup. It's our time to shine because we got to go on a win streak. That's a green from the left wing, 4-3. to three. We're going to drive in, somehow get that contested layup to go. And 
As you guys have seen the bottom left corner, and if you've obviously been watching the video, we're a 79 overall. We're really almost getting towards 99. You know what I'm saying? The build's coming together. We can score offensively. I'm pulling from the parking lot right there. I don't know what I was thinking, uh, but he's going to get the rebound. But it's really time, bro. We're starting to you know, figure this build out. We did just lose last game, but right here, this is going to be the beginning of our new win streak you know what i'm saying we got to get in their groove and i'm feeling confident that last kid just had our number i don't know what to tell you look at me dribbling combo one up into the corner for a three four to twelve step back or it was snatch back for a three another green 15 to four i'm gonna lose my voice doing this video bro drop a like sub up even comment right now comment i'm gonna say a random word comment uh tangerine Yo, if you comment Tangerine, I know you're loyal because no one else is randomly commenting that. So comment that, sub up, drop a like. But it's 20 to 4, and this is for our 80 overall. If we win this, we can go to 80. Finally, we are into the 80 overalls, 20 and 11 record. And I'm thinking, what do I upgrade? I'm looking at close shot. I'm looking at uh, standing dunk. I'm looking at our defense. Is it time to go defense? And if I do go defense, what do I do first? Do I do block, steal, perimeter D, interior D? And... I decided to go with speed. Uh, just figured it would help us defensively, more importantly, but even offensively a little bit. So we will go ahead and do speed, but defense is still untouched. We're gonna have to do that soon, but we are now an 80 overall. This next kid looks to be pretty comp, but what is his overall? You guys see we're still rocking our brown shirt. We got a 95 overall, level 34, and his name is like Chayeo or something. I don't know how to say it. You guys see it in the bottom right corner, but we gotta lock in. We cannot let this kid beat us. You know, we just lost a few games ago. We gotta get on a winning streak as i've been stressing you were going to the left wing green five nothing against my boy chayo and we got the pink ball so shout out to him you know my ball was starting to get a little boring just the orange regular ball but chayo decided to bring a pink ball to the galleon so we appreciate you chayo comment that if you guys are watching we appreciate you for the pink ball chayo nine to nothing we got takeover double takeover because on current you know there's no regular takeover. Every time you get it, it's double takeover. We're going crazy, snatching it back, top of the key. We're going to dribble right by him. 13 to nothing against Chayo, and we are in the 80 overalls. So this is, in my mind, you know, when I was playing, this is almost like we're, we're almost at the finish line. You know what I'm saying? Like, this is like near the end you know what i mean we're upgraded too so we shouldn't really be losing we shouldn't really be losing we're near the final version of the build as we are going crazy here 19 to nothing against chayo can we get the 21 0 yes we can as we dunk it down on chayo 21 0 win as our record moves to 21 and 11 now we can go to an 81 overall we're gonna upgrade our perimeter defense up to a 77 the first defensive stat to be upgraded on our entire build now this guy looks pretty small and when i saw that i was like all right bet like i'm just gonna go up over him every time we got an 80 overall tj6628 sorry tj but you're about to get body look at him oh my god over his head like that is this build like that keep in mind i only have an 80 driving hook my finishing isn't really upgraded i did upgrade my driving layup a little bit but i didn't max it out yet close shots not maxed out and i'm making crazy layups on this kid look at this eight nothing and everything is uh, okay maybe not everything's going in i did miss one but tj generously is gonna miss the shot and then give us the ball right back we have double takeover eight nothing tj is uh screwed Left wing, 11 nothing, and yeah, TJ is basically giving up. He's just standing still. I might do that too if I was TJ6628 and I was like 5'7 or whatever he's doing with that build. We're not really sure what he was thinking of, but 17 nothing. We're going to green up on the right wing for a two. Just keep in mind, I did not still upgrade my midi. Maybe I should do that soon, but yeah, we're pulling from the parking lot. 22 to nothing win as our record goes on to 22 and 11, and now we can go two. 82 overall and we're gonna upgrade our block to a 78 our defense starting to come together here as we start to upgrade things defensively it might be it's honestly a little crazy that i didn't do anything until i was like 80 overall 81 overall anything defensively but we're gonna keep um up to date with our badges because as we upgrade the build we gotta make sure that we're putting on the best badges that we could put on. So I went in and I did that. We got a 90 overall. What is his name? Sedan Baby 5. And he is going to get cut off from a baseline layup right there. And it's time to cook. It's time to cook, bro. 
We're going on a little winning streak. Our last loss was at 79 overall. So we have won, I believe, that is three games straight because we won at 79, we won at 80, we won at 81. So that I think is three, maybe four. I don't know. The math's kind of weird when we're, you know, I don't know. It gets kind of weird, but seven nothing against Saddam, baby. Now it's nine nothing. We're cooking. Quick drops is my best friend, bro, especially in a challenge like this where my build's not max, but I have the best dunk package game. Look at that. Quick drops, bro. I'll be taking off from like the free throw line with that shit. They honestly, if you want to make the best 2K, you got to take that out next year. To get 24, you got to take that out because OP moves like that. Yeah, maybe they make the game a little fun. And look at that offensive rebound. That was just crazy, but yeah, maybe they make the game a little easier. You know, OP moves, but if you want a better game, shit, you should probably take out stuff like that. And this kid's gonna stop playing too as I'm up 16 now, 19 to nothing. I had to check to see if he dashboarded, but nah, he's still in the game. Saddam Baby is gonna lose 22 to nothing. I mean, I'm just smoking kids at this point. We're smoking kids. We can go on to 83 overall now. And look, I can max out my interior D and get some steel. Now it is gonna be almost 18 KVC for one overall is outrageous. And by the way, this is just the beginning. That is that is not the craziest you will see the VC prices be for one overall. But once again, we're up getting our defense. So we got to go in make sure we have on the right defensive badge because this whole time I've been using basically no defensive badges. I couldn't put them on because I hadn't upgraded my build. We got a 92 overall. He's got the blue hair, the blue shorts. The Is that blue shoes or black shoes? I don't know. But he's matching. He's matching. He's a little smart. You know what I'm saying? He's color coordinated. Maybe he's good at 2K. Cause you know, usually if you see someone that's all over the place, I mean, they're, they're, they're probably pretty bad. You know what I'm saying? They got a green beard, a red hat, a yellow shorts on. Like it's usually a pretty bad sign for them. I mean, that's a great sign for us, but this kid's matching a little bit, but is he good? It's not looking like it. I mean, this kid cannot stop me. What's his name? Flank I, I that might be how you pronounce it, but we're just cooking left wing and to go right past him. I believe that was a quick drops 11 to nothing. And we are 83 overall. I'm going to bring it back. He probably thought I was shooting a three, but I'm not. We're taking the dunk. Honestly, I could have. We do have double takeover comboing up the drill moves looking just clean, bro. Just so clean. I'm really dribbling like I would on, you know, any other build that's actually upgraded it's not like the old 60 overall days as we're just cooking this kid 18 to nothing a three will end it but we're gonna take it to 20 to nothing can we finish off this game and did this kid even touch the ball i don't even know but we're gonna miss that shot so there it is he will get a chance to come back on the big so but can he do it keep in mind we did upgrade the defense a little bit we have locked take he got his own board and we have not upgraded the rebounding yet so that might be a problem but the chase down we just upgraded block a little bit ago and the chase down is in full effect 22 to nothing now we can go on to 84 overall as we are going to upgrade our steel a little bit more up to an 83 now we're an 84 overall the build is starting to come together nicely the defense getting upgraded but we're versing the green lantern season six suit guy of hell pg sap 35 what did that say a 98 overall level 35 i think it said he's starting out with some green six nothing but i do get the close out and we get the ball it's time to lock in this is our 84 overall game something interesting is like which overall do i play the best at obviously it's going to be like 99 in the long run but in this video which overall do i dominate the most at we definitely had some earlier that i dominated at but it's going to be interesting to see you know which overalls am i the best at which give me a little a little struggle but i mean i feel like that kind of depends more on my opponent not really the overall because as the overall goes up the bill gets better so that doesn't really make sense but i'm cooking up until that point where I miss a shot and he misses a shot too. So we get the ball right back eight to six. I'm going to go around and we have double take. Both of us do 10 to six. Honestly, next year, they need to limit the amount of uh, like how fast you can get takeover, not limit the amount, but how fast you can get takeover. Because look at this. Both of us have takeover like the entire game. And that's not normal. I feel like that should not happen. But I'm cooking this kid 14 to 9. I'm just going to take my little rim run. Cooking him again. Going to go right past him. 16 to 9. PG Sav 
35 cannot hold me. He cannot hold me. I'm mixing him on the right wing. Gonna go right past him again. Another quick drops. 18 and on. Ever since I equipped quick drops, it's just been smooth sailing. I feel like we have not lost a game since I was a 79 overall. We're in a little five game heater. This is for six. This is for the 85 overall upgrade. We do it. 22 to 9. It's time to upgrade. But what should I do? Now look. I'm going for a three-pointer to an 83. And then a little block, I think that was. A little something on defense. But look, I'm only going to an 83 three-pointer because now I can put on the jumper of dreams, we're going to call it. It's kind of crazy, but jumper of dreams. The best jump shot in the game. The Kyle Kuzma, Oscar, Oscar. If you know about my jump shots, if you've been watching my jump shot videos this year, you just, I don't know if you've been watching me this year. You know that's the jumper. I use the best jumper in the game of my PN so smooth. And now we're playing a level 40, 98 overall, most likely goat tier. Like I said earlier, it's glitched. Three and D point. We're going to call him No Limit because I think that's what his name should be. But he spelt it wrong. So we're going to call him No Limit though. Let's see if he's actually good at the game. Or maybe he's just a no life and hit level 40. Or maybe he's just good and got it fast because of that. 4 nothing. he's going to take a bad shot. We get the board. It's time to lock in. We cannot mess around in this challenge anymore because I don't want to take any more L's. I do not want to take any more L's. And this might be the toughest game of the entire challenge remaining. A level 40? Am I going to play more level 40s to finish us out? Maybe. But... I know this is going to be one of the toughest games. We're at 85 overall, and we get a lock, and I'm taking my rim runs here early. I'm going to walk it back, top of the key for three, and it's not going to go. So he does get the ball back, but what is he going to do with it? Nothing, because I steal it right back. We got double take, sharp, and lock, of course. I'm going to rim run right past him, and we got the lead, eight to four. We just got to keep scoring anyway. How? I don't care. You know what I'm saying? If he's going to play me high, kind of eliminate my three, I'm going to go past you because... I can dribble and I can rim run pretty well. Look at that right there. I missed, but I get my own board and the layup is good. That's the thing about me. You got to kind of play me a little back. You got to kind of play me in the middle because initially I'm going to look to rim run. If you're playing me high, I'll take the rim run. That's free. But if you're going to need time a jumper, I could do that too, as you guys can see. But I'm just not going to be shooting in your face. You know what I'm saying? If you're going to back off though, then I'll shoot. And I think that's the method that a lot of people should do against me on defense. I would say sag off a little bit. Make me think. Make me make a decision. Make me try and shoot a sh shot. You know what I'm saying? Um, 19-4 though. 19-4 gets a level 40, 98 overall. And we're going to get the win. 21-4 to 4. now. We can go to 86 overall. We're getting close. We are getting close to the end of the journey. And I'm thinking, what should I upgrade? I'm looking around perimeter defense. Possibly it's going to be 16K. If I want to put that up, I can go up to an 84. And I am going to do so. Now, quickly, we're going to go look at the badges. We can get challenger up to silver. We still, you know, we didn't do steel. So we can't get glove on silver yet. But that's something I'm looking at. Clamps. I want to get that on silver ASAP. But, you know, we, we didn't upgrade enough for that. We're only an 86 overall. And we are playing an 87. Clean psycho. He's wearing the sweatshirt. We know. If you're wearing that sweatshirt... That's a bad sign for you. Great sign for me. Because apparently everyone that wears that sweatshirt, I don't know where it's from, but everyone that I that wears that sweatshirt, I destroy them. So I don't know. It's like a good luck charm for me. Like if my opponent's wearing that sweatshirt, like it's like, you know what I'm saying? It's like my lucky day. It's my lucky day. Two nothing though. His name is Clean Psycho. So actually he spelled psycho wrong now that i'm looking at it but for nothing we're cooking up right wing stepping back he's kind of i i, I kind of read it bro he's letting me shoot so i'll shoot bro if he's gonna play me low i'm gonna shoot i'm gonna shoot i'm gonna go right past him now it is nine nothing 86 overall man we're getting close to 90 the 90s i mean bro i i can't lose in the 90s when i once i'm at 90 plus even right now bro i can't lose you know what i'm saying i i, I gotta really lock in Try not to lose again. We have not lost a game since 79 overall. And this one is very much looking like a win here as the layup's not going to go. Psycho with a chance. He's going to score a couple points. Now it is 14 to 6. As I said earlier, we're going to fast forward through a lot of the opponent's possessions just because we don't want a long ass video. I'm going to dribble right past them. 16 to 6. Let's put clean Psycho away. Left wing. Three is good. 19 to 6. And we need one bucket to secure the win and go on to 87 overall as I combo up, go right past him and we win 21 to six clean psycho gave us no problems.
you guys see 21 to 6 9 for 11 on shooting three for three from three i'm really not missing but look we're gonna max out everything defensively except defensive rebound we'll get to that later but look our defense is coming together now we're in 87 overall the build look at it look at it it's really coming together we got to do close shot still and uh mid-range of course but i mean overall the build is almost done the build is almost done and we have a record of 27 and 11 we are in 87 overall as you can see and we are playing a phase member phase x jabu i think that says yeah it does and he is i think it said 84 overall let's see what this dude is about because you know phase they recently made some 2k you know they made a 2k part of their clan and i think jabu is a real phase member so that's pretty cool shout out to jabu because i always wanted to play him and you know here we are we're versus a real phase member so that's pretty cool but we gotta get the win we gotta get the win for nothing left wing i'm comboing up he's disrespecting the shots why would you disrespect this shot we're upgraded now double take right wing green i got the little green animation okay 10 nothing against jabu we gotta put him away he's still disrespecting the shot another green animation 13 nothing i haven't missed this shot another one right hash green 16 nothing jabu step up step up Okay, maybe you don't have to step up. Jabu going to go in for the layup. Miss it. I get the board 16 to 2. He did score. I ended up cutting it out just to make things quicker. I get the quick drop to there. 18 to 2. A 3 will end the game. Left wing. He's still disrespecting me. I decided to fade. Oh, my God. The build is so much upgraded now that I'm fading threes. That was my first ever made fade three on the build. And it's time to upgrade. We can go to an 88 overall. And we are doing close shot and a little bit of defensive rebound so now our close shot is completely maxed out and we're in 88 overall how many more games is that 12 more games uh you know 12 more over or 11 more overalls i don't know the math kind of you know i haven't you know i haven't really been going to school bro so you know you can't blame me but you mathematicians out there if we got any fourth graders that have been doing the times table you know what i'm saying you uh got that math easy let me know what it is in the comment section no, nah, but actually, um, it's kind of confusing just because 88 to 99 is obviously 11, but then I have to play another game. So I think it's 12. I think it's 12. You know what I mean? Uh, but look at this. This kid stopped playing BST cash because we're just like that. You know what I'm saying? Why would you play defense when you're versing me? Uh, you don't got to play defense when you're playing me because I'll just go out of bounds and you beat a ball, apparently. BST cash going to try and score. Let's see. I, I think this kid's pretty decent. He's dead, though. I noticed that. We got to clamp him up. Post fade. Not going to go. I get the board. Nine to nothing. Let's put this kid away. He flopped. We took advantage of it. Left wing. Green. Come on. Let's go on a win streak as we are on a win streak. We have not lost a game since 79 overall. I'm going to keep on saying that until we lose another game. If we even lose another game. Right now, in your head, will we lose another game? We're 88 overall, 28 and 11 record. The build is almost maxed out. Will we lose another game in this challenge going to 99? And keep in mind, no, this is not fake. This is not rigged. This is not staged. I streamed all of these games live in case you were wondering, oh, well, maybe if he loses, he'll just take it out of the video. Like, no, I streamed it all live. They are up on my channel, all the live streams. 20 to 5, we need one bucket to continue the win streak to, I believe it would be 10, and we would have a 29-11 record and be able to upgrade to 89 overall. We are almost 90 overall on this build from this challenge as we drive in. Don't get the layup, but we get our own board. We're going to bring it out. Double take. Am I going to shoot it? We do have sharp take. No, I'm going to run right past him for the win. 22 to 5. Our record moves on to 29-11. I believe that is a 10-game win streak in this challenge this is crazy we're gonna max out the driving lip and then do a little bit more to defensive rebound as we're pretty much running out of things to upgrade you guys can see don't have much left but we will go on to the badges because you know as we continue to upgrade things and especially defensively we got to make sure we have on the right badges rebound chaser one of the only defensive badges i still cannot put on but we're going to get that soon as we continue to upgrade defensive rebound we are now an 89 overall playing a 92 overall but let's be honest, we take those matchups all day as this guy's going to come out shooting 9 nothing. So, I mean, yeah, 92 overall versus me and 89, which I feel like I'm the, I'm the favorite still in this matchup because now I'm upgraded. 
you know you got to expect me to win a matchup like this but he came out shooting you know what i'm saying he came out good nine nothing lead to start but we fight back we fight back now we're down five to nine gonna take another dunk it is now nine to seven in his favor right wing i got double take but so does he we're pulling from the hash it's late it's late, but he's going to take one of the weirdest shots I've ever seen in my entire life. After scoring a bucket, it's 11 to 7. Left wing for a three. It's good. 11 to 10, and we are down by one on the right wing. Combo and up, getting right by him. 11 to 12, bro. No one can guard me. Like, it's crazy. It's really crazy. Nah, let me stop. Let me stop. But re realistically, I low key be dribbling crazy on this game. I don't even play it like that. I don't even play it like that. But we're going to pull from way fucking from the parking lot. Oh my God. From the parking lot, we're pulling and it's green and we're going to get by him once again. Bro, my dribbling, this is what I meant to say. My dribbling mixed with the quick drops animation is unguardable. Like it really is. Unless you're sitting paint. And you're just praying on me to miss a shot. But look, we can go to 90 overall. Oh my God, bro. We started out at 60. Every game is plus one. And look at us. We maxed out the defensive rebound. We did a little bit to our standing dunk, which is actually an underrated attribute. And now I'm going to go ahead and put on rebound chaser. I do believe I think I lowered workhorse there. And we're in 90 overall. 30 and 11 record and we were playing another 92 but like i said that's not scary this dude averages five points per game if i'm like bro if i'm gonna be scared at a 90 overall i don't know what i would have to see i think it would have to be like a 99 overall post score or maybe like a level 40 99 legend i don't know but we're pretty upgraded now we should not lose another game from here on out as we are on i believe 11 game winning streak and we're just frying this kid we're just comboing up getting by him every single play nine to nothing i got double takeover now how can he guard me when i have sharp take but at the same time i can get by him every play if i wanted to 11 nothing against madman trillo we're comboing up we're, we're mad deep and we're still getting by him we're still getting by him 13 to nothing and i mean we know what we know what's gonna i'm just mixing this kid up i'm mixing him you just can't stop me we're getting by him and uh right wing once again i think i love the right wing i think i could tell that from this gameplay we're pulling though oh my god i mean i'm taking dunks i'm i'm shooting threes what can't this build do what can't this build do again bill video soon if this video goes crazy you guys comment you want the bill video drop a ton of likes if uh you know new subs from this video whatever drop in the bill video soon but that's another 22 oh oh my bro how many 22 o's 21 o's have i gotten in this video it seems like a lot bro and we're gonna go ahead and upgrade again i honestly missed it it was so fast i think that was three point though now we're 91 overall yeah look at this we're putting our limitless range on silver max limitless range for this build which is pretty good silver is is very good silver's good gold's a little bit better but we'll take silver and we got our next match up here 91 overall game if we win this we're moving on to 92 man we're almost done this has been a crazy challenge a crazy journey this video has taken me so long to make not only play the games but edit them and stream them and grind my oh my bro I spent like a week grinding my career for this one video, bro. So I don't know. I think it's turned out pretty good, but look at us. 91 overall game. This is for 92. We're going to go and force a layup. What am I doing on Palmer Jam 23? My boy Palmer, shout out to him. But we're going to get the board, combo up, and get by him for the dunk. Four to two. You already know what we're doing. We're mixing him up, of course, on the right wing. You know, if I was defending me, bro, if I was defending me, but obviously they don't know that because they have never played me before, I would just blitz my right side, bro, off the inbound. Off the inbound, when they inbound it to me, I'm sprinting and stealing it from me because I always go right, pretty much, off the inbound. First move, usually. Sometimes I go left, but usually it's right. And I'm just cooking this kid. I'm cooking him, right wing. Once again, you know what I'm saying? That's like my favorite spot, apparently. That's my favorite spot. And we're going to take a dunk 13 to 2 against Palmer Jam. We're pulling. Oh my God. I mean, he's confused. He's like, How, what can't this kid do? He's like, he's shooting threes. He's taking dunks. It's like he's dribbling like crazy. What, how do I guard him? How, and it's like, you really can't, bro. You really, you just can't, Palmer Jam. You can't hang with the big so. 20 to 2. One bucket will end the game. And he's playing defense from behind me. He's putting his hands up. He doesn't know what to do. We're taking the dunk. Now we can go to 92 overall as our record goes to 32 and 11. 
Again, 13 game win streak, I do believe. And we are gonna go ahead and put our three point to an 88, which is max. Look at the build. We are almost maxed out as we are now a 92 overall. Jumping into the next game, we are versing a dude with a blue afro. He does have on a brown shirt, but is he a fake brown shirt? No, he's not. I don't think so. 79 overall, and this is the shot that he goes up with on the first possession. Soccer pro, 4-2-3. What are we cooking? We are now a 92 overall with a record of 32 and 11. We have not lost a game since we were 79 overall. We are on a 13 game win streak in this challenge as we are cooking up. And we should have a pretty free win here. We should have a pretty free win versus Soccer Pro, the 79 overall. I mean, we are the heavy favorites in this one. We're comboing up, greening from the left wing and soccer pro should not even touch the ball for the remainder of the game as we're going to combo up go right by him i mean he's screwed defensively he's slow look at him he's sitting in the paint and we're just going to keep greening if he's going to sit low then we're going to green but if he plays high we're going to run right by him he seems pretty slow like he doesn't have enough speed to really guard us as we green up on the right wing 20 to nothing and now we can upgrade to 93 overall as our record is now 33 and 11 with a 23-0 win. We missed one shot, nine for 10, five from six from three. But now what do we upgrade? We're running out of things to upgrade. I decided to go with one toward my three point and three toward my ball handle. So we now have a maxed out three point. I might've mentioned that we maxed it out in a few, like a last game, I think it was, but no, we had one more to go. So now it is maxed. Now we put on the correct shooting badges, our finishing, or not finishing, playmaking can go clamp breaker gold, but quick first step can still not go Hall of Fame. So after this game, We'll probably upgrade playmaking and get quick for step Hall of Fame. But look at this dude, Grizzy's turn. He's got the same gamer tag as me, except he's got his own, whatever his name, Grizzy's obviously. So I'm thinking, is this a stream sniper? Cause obviously I was streaming during this challenge and I don't know, I will never know to this day, but he was trying to body me. As you saw earlier, he tried to catch a body. Now he's not playing. I'm gonna green up on the right wing, six to four to get the lead. And we're at 93 overall. We really should not lose another game in this entire challenge as we have, what is it? Six more wins to go, seven more wins, something like that. As we're just gonna combo, pull in his face, green, 11 to four. And bro, if you're still watching this video, shout out to you, bro. You're a real one. Drop a like, sub up, and let me know if you guys want the build video, if you still haven't commented that by now, because I mentioned it like three times, but I will drop that eventually. But man, I mean, this this video has just been hella long and we're almost at the end, bro. We're almost at the end. We really almost completed the journey. 60 overall to 99 overall. Who else is doing this? I don't I don't think anyone has. I don't think anyone has legitimately done this challenge on YouTube. Some people have won, you know, a game at 60 and then a game at 75 and then a game at 99 or they'll skip around or start at 70 overall. Or, But I don't think anyone's ever done it all the way through from 60 to 99 legit as we get another win, 21 to four and our record is now 34 and 11 we can go on to 94 overall perfect game nine for nine from the field three for three from three now we're gonna max out our ball handle and our speed of the ball and even get a little bit of mid-range right there we are 94 overall oh my god that feels good to say and now we can go quick first step to Hall of Fame. We'll have to take off Ankle Breaker, but that's okay because that badge isn't the best. Although once I do get my extra badges on this build by you know doing the flashback games and whatever else, the Sam Quest or whatever it is, I will be able to get Ankle Breaker. And we're versing a level 36. And this dude's actually pretty decent, it looks like. Five nothing start, he's got ball, obviously. Body bag, Zay, one, one, zero, zero. He's gonna miss the shot though and give us the ball early. So all we have to do is come back down five. He didn't really score too much, not too much of a threat. We do get a dunk there on the first possession for us. Walk back to the top of the key for three. And it's a tie game just like that. Brown shirt, so now my 94, I probably should have copped some drip. You know what I'm saying? But, you know, clothing's kind of expensive. And when they're going 60 to 99, I mean, I'm gonna have to spend like 700 KVC on this build in one video, which is low key crazy. Most videos, I just go to like 85 or 90. But this one, we're going all the way to 99. And I mean, I am gonna use this build after this challenge. So at least that, at least there's that. But look at us. He's low key clamping us to this possession. But we're gonna hit him with the step back on the left wing for three with no stamina. That shot's actually pretty impressive. 14 to five now. We're just comboing up on the right wing. And right now, I'm in my groove. You can tell as I'm gonna green from the top of the key. And I just don't see anybody stopping us from the remainder of this challenge. Like, 
you could tell bro i'm really in my bag as we're gonna green up from the right wing and one more to go we're gonna drive past him take the dunk and now we can go to 95 overall oh my god bro we're really almost done we're really almost done look at this i'm gonna do mid-range but look at this it's 40,000 vc to go to like a 70 mid-range a 70 mid-range costs 40,000 vc it's not even that high of a mid-range just 15 upgrades i'm looking at the vc prices because bro that's like over 20 dollars, i think or over 10 somewhere in that range and now we're a 95 overall we have not lost a game since we were a 79 overall we are on a 16 game winning streak and we are playing a 96 overall most hated cap it says he has a little wizard hat on so i don't know if he's a wizard at 2k we're about to find out if he's actually like that or maybe he's just putting on an act you know what i'm saying with that hat on because you can't be rocking that hat and not be good at 2k we're up three to nothing or here early pulling another three that's a green Six nothing against most hated cap. He's reaching. We're spinning back. Green. Oh my God. We got double takeover. Nine nothing. Just like that. This is the 95 overall game. We're almost done. What is it? Four more overalls to go. He's not even playing. It's another one of these kids. You know what I'm saying? We start smoking them so bad that they just stop playing. We're going for the perfect game. We missed, of course. Of course we missed it, but we do get a steal. We're gonna have to fight for the ball though. Can we get it? We do come away with it, 18 nothing. And this dude is breaking his neck and falling on the ground, flopping. I would do the same if I was up against the big so. As we get the win, 21 to zero, one shot away from a perfect game. We were seven for eight on the 21-0 win against Cap. Now, we're upgrading mid-range. What else do we have to upgrade? Strength is gonna be maxed out. And even, I think we end up doing a little bit of vertical here because there's not too many things to upgrade. We're playing one, so free throw and pass accuracy aren't gonna help. So yeah, we're gonna do a little bit of vertical, a little bit of everything, even offensive rebound. We got two attributes there. You can't forget about offensive rebound. You know, it's very small, but we do have a 27 offensive rebound. Jumping into the next game. We are now a 96 overall going up against a 97 level 35 so on paper this guy should beat us right he's a little bit better apparently according to the overall according to the level you know what i'm saying he's just more of a grinder than us he just is but we're gonna work our way in there and just get a little layup or is that close shot i think that might be close shot then we're pulling a three right wing five nothing against just licks in the final games of this challenge we're gonna blow by him blow past him I don't know why that kind of sounded sus at first, but we're gonna blow past him for the dunk. And once again, we're trying to work our way in. Can we get the layup? No, but we get our own board. This guy in the bucket hat stands no chance. We get the board. That's why we all, that's why we upgraded the offensive rebound. You know what I'm saying? You might think it doesn't make a difference, but going from a 25 to a 27, that's why we got that offensive board. That's why we that's why we play, man. That's why we did it. And we're still pulling. I mean, I'm just sparking against this kid. Oh my god. Is that three or four straight threes in a row against him? We're pulling from the parking lot. Oh my god. 21-0 win. This build is like that. I didn't even know I could pull from that deep. I mean, you guys are seeing every game I'm playing on this build. So this is me literally learning what the build can do. And I'm pulling from mad deep. 97 overall we upgraded the rest of our vertical and a little bit of our pass accuracy and this is pretty much it man this guy to me does not look too good off rip but we will see what his overall is he's a 90 i think that 98 i think that says rich slime 2 and we gotta win this game we got a few more games to close out the challenge and rich slime 2 should not be able to hold us we get a 37 and 11 record which is just crazy that's crazy going from 60 to 99 and we are on an 18 game win streak that's absurd that you got to give me my props that's absurd eight nothing to start the game i'm just cooking this kid i'm cooking him he thinks i'm shooting a three i'll go behind the back to the rim 10 nothing against rich slime we're cooking up right by him he's playing me high i'll take the dunk it's okay it is okay we're cooking oh my god don't reach the last thing you want to do against me is reach it'll throw you out of the play and it's just a bad idea do what i do on defense i play straight up i rarely reach i don't think i ever reach as he can get a block on me a rare block and he has double take he hasn't scored a point but he has double take and that's the shot that he ended up going with that is crazy but he does end up getting a quick dunk 16 to 2 can rich slime 2 come back against me no 
It's not looking like it as we're going to get the board. We're going to dribble around, get past him. 18 to 2, a 3 will end it. Am I going to go for the 3? Yes. Left wing. It's green. 21 to 2. And our record is now 38 and 11 as we can now go to 98 overall, which is basically 99. When you look at this, look, we're one away from max on the free throw. Everything else is upgraded. We're basically 99, but we're not because it says we're 98. So we got to win this game. And then we are officially maxed out 99. And we're playing a 95 overall level 18 YBC AJ. But that's really crazy. Win one game, plus one to your overall. I mean, we're doing it. We're doing it. We're literally one attribute away. One win away from finishing the challenge. And of course, we will play a game at 99 once we do get that win. But are we getting the win here? YBC AJ is up 14 to nothing. And he just ripped me once I did get a stop. Is YBC AJ putting a rain on our parade? 16 to nothing AJ double takeover he's in the paint and oh my god great defense for me little anchor animation from behind and we're gonna pull a three 16 to three am I gonna pull off the one of the greatest comebacks in 2k history 2k challenge history with the whole challenge on the line remember we have not lost a game since we were a 79 overall and we are behind by a lot but the score is 16 to 9. We're fighting. Double takeover for both players. We're on the right wing. Comboing up. Walk back. Right wing. Three. I'm locked in. I'm. You know I'm locked. Oh my God. Oh my God. YBC AJ ripped me. 18 to 12. He's dribbling around. A three will win it. AJ dribbling. He's going to go into the paint. Leo. Not going to go. But he gets his own board. He's pump faking it. Oh my God, bro. We cannot lose at 98 overall. He missed the dunk. He missed the wide open dunk. And we're going to go in and take the dunk. 18 to 14. We're down by four. We're down by two. We take a dunk. 18 to 16. Is AJ going to have a colossal collapse with the challenge on the line? 18 to 18. Is this one of the greatest comebacks in 2K history? Walk back. I'm pulling in his face. Oh my God. I missed it. AJ with another chance to win. Oh my God. He's in for the layup, but he missed it. We got to contest from behind. A three will win it. AJ with the D top of the key from the parking lot. Green. Oh my God. What a way to hit 99 overall. That's the craziest way it could have went down. Literally the craziest. 16-0 comeback we pulled from the parking lot 99 overall you guys see it this is what the build looks like it's good at everything the build is good at everything like i said go crazy on this video sub up drop a ton of likes comment you if you want the build video here are the final badges i'll drop the build video soon but now we gotta win a game at 99 overall we can't finish the challenge Without winning a game in 99 overall, that would be kind of lame. You know what I'm saying? We hit 99, but we don't even play at 99? We don't even get to see the build's full capabilities? Oh, no. H, I don't even know what to call him. Let's call him Hoods. Hoods is up 2-0. He's pulling. He missed it. Okay. We got to stop the bleeding early. You know what I'm saying? He got ball first. That's just lucky. You know what I'm saying? He started with ball, but we got to we gotta lock in. You know what I'm saying? He only scored two. That's fine. We're pulling. Right wing. Oh, no. Don't tell me I grounded this build to 99 for no reason. For nothing, though, we got our own offensive rebound. That's why we got a little 27 offensive rebound on this build. So we can get bo boards like that. Obviously, I'm joking. If you think I'm serious, because I said that like twice now, I'm kidding. But we're green up in the left wing. We're taking a layup. Nine to two. Right wing. We're dribbling, getting by him. But we get another. Oh, shit. Um, maybe we should have upgraded our offensive rebound more in this build. Um... Nah, I'm trolling, but I don't know how that went to his hands, but uh, we're clamping him. We're clamping him. The defense on this build is insane. Literally, you saw the build, man. Everything's insane. Pull back for three. Green. 12 to 2. The final plays of this challenge. We're walking him back. We're going in. Quick drops. Best dunk package in the game. This build at 99 is different. Look at me dribbling. Comboing up. Oh, my God. The green on the left wing. I'm really starting to play like myself. 
like myself from my other builds he gets a lucky steal animation like i think we all know there's nothing skilled about that what does he have like gold glove on or something just clicks x and we get to stop right back because we're skilled the build's good we're fading right corner green this build can do everything you name it this build can do it and we are one shot away from in the challenge spin back game we finished the challenge off with a 22 to two win at 99 overall. And the final record is right there on your screen, 40 and 11. We went on a 20 game win streak to finish out the 60 to 99 challenge. One win is plus one to my overall on a 20 game win streak. That is absurd. And if you calculate, you know, the win percentage with a 40 and 11 record, that is a 78 win percentage. That's crazy. I feel like there's no other way to put it. That is crazy because I started as a 60 overall with basically no badges and I still have a 78 win percentage. That's better than a lot of people's actual win percentages on upgraded builds. You know, I had to lock in for the challenge. I had to, I had to go crazy. 78 win percentage, 40 and 11 record. And let me know. Don't cheat. Do not cheat. How many of you guys predicted that I would have 11 total losses by the end of this challenge? Because I know when I was streaming it, it was looking like I was going to have a lot. I started off bad. I started off like 500. I was like 10 and 10 or something like that. But wow. I mean, we really locked in, went like 30 and one in my last 31 games and 99 overall, man. That's crazy. Again, if you guys want the build video, go crazy on this video. Sub up, smash the like button, comment below if I should post a build video because I will do that soon. This build will obviously work on next gen as well. I know that I did this video on current gen, but this is a 6-8 demigod build that can do everything. Appreciate you guys for watching. Uh, there will be videos popping up on the screen similar to this one, although I've done nothing like this, so I don't know what's going to pop up. But yeah, man, check out these other videos. Sub up if you're new and drop a like. Appreciate you for watching. I'm out.